In this video, we're going to do some math, but before you click away, it is just some simple subtraction and division that can help us calculate whether we can lift an entire house by cluster ballooning, just like in the movie, Up. Now, unlike hot air balloons, cluster ballooning is a technique that uses a bunch of small sealed helium balloons to lift out a person, a basket, or even an entire house. A regular house weighs around 40 to 80 tons, and if we change it into pounds and take the average, that's around 130,000 pounds for a regular house. To know how many balloons do we need to lift the entire house, first we need to calculate how much helium gas do we need. Helium is slighter than air. It rises because it has a lower density. Air has a density of 0.077 pounds per cubic foot, while helium has a density of 0.011. To know how heavy a cubic foot of helium can carry, we can simply subtract the two and obtain the number 0.066 pounds. And because we have 130,000 pounds we need to carry, it means we will need around 2 million cubic feet of helium, which is over 20 times the size of the Olympic swimming pool. Now, how do we hold such an amount of helium gas? If you use regular party balloons that have a diameter of one foot, we will then need around 3.8 million balloons, which is over twice the number of balloons released in that crazy balloon fest in 1986, which had 1.5 million balloons released to the sky. But if we choose to use larger balloons that have three times the diameter, we'll only need around 140,000 balloons, which is still a lot considering we didn't take into account the weight of the balloon themselves and all the strings and ropes. So after all, is it possible to lift an entire house off the ground using helium balloons? The answer is yes. In fact, in 2011, National Geographic has already claimed the world record for the largest balloon cluster flight by lifting a house with 2,000 pounds and 250 square feet. The house is small, so it only took 300 weather balloons, which are huge balloons designed for high altitude flight. In just one hour, the balloons brought the house up to 10,000 feet, which was almost four times the height of the Dubai Tower. Anyway, now we know we can live an entire house using balloons, but do you know how high can a balloon actually go? Well, check out my other video right here and you will find the answer.